Hello my friends, I am excited to be here. Welcome back to the Nova Covert Ops Redux mod. I am having a lot of technical issues today. <laughs> So, we're going to see how things go. However, I should make it very apparent that um, I I installed a new graphics card today. I haven't got all the 4K stuff set up yet because I've been running into a bunch of other issues. For example, can't run StarCraft in windowed full screen anymore. Has to be exact full screen. Otherwise, it just gets stuck on the first frame forever. So, that's cool. I'm having a lot of other issues as well. So, I'm just going to I'm gonna learn about stuff. We're going to take the C-10 canister rifle. We're going to take, uh, uh, th this? Yeah, let's get this. Uh, unit technology. We talked about the cloaked old uh, Reaper. Seems like a good idea. Then we get Liberators, so I feel like the healing zone on Liberator will be pretty good for them. Uh, I'm not really seeing anything else that seems that out of an the ordinary. Oh, 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 we should get the, we should get the internal tech module on this guy. That's a really good idea. It will mean that we have, uh, one, one for free. Then reduces the train time of SCVs. Mm, there's nowhere to jump jet in this mission. There's nowhere to jump jet in most missions. Let's be completely honest. Let's transfer this over here. Let's grab, oh, oh, could we get, uh, can we equipped on Marine Marauder Hellbat SCV? Yeah, why not? We'll give it to, we'll give it to the, the bat. Interesting. Yeah, thank you, Rigel. And then what do we got over here? 10 life per second on the Predator, Cloak Predator, Predator Speed. Yeah, I'm not really feeling the Predator this mission. I think that this is really it. We're not seeing a whole lot of new stuff for this mission, but Cloaked Reapers, does sound like a pretty good time to me. So we are going to give it a go. Never played this mission Cloak Reaper before. <laughs> I can't, can't imagine many people have. <laughs> I believe it's permanent cloak on the Reapers too, which, I mean, that is, that's pretty strong, right? I figure that this might be a good mission for it because there's not static detection. So we'll we'll see how it works. I think that perfectly is going to be the answer. So let's uh, lift up and go over here. Move this bad boy. Move this bad boy. And start. I like how the <laughs> how that spawn in the mineral line. I love it. Let's get a biomechanical engineering bay in order to get some biomechanical upgrades. So, 1-1 one, one is free, uh, might as well upgrade this to the fancy thing, and let's give one of these first little operation centers a go. Oh, apparently I have V-Sync off, that's cool. It's not intentional. <laughs> as I said, tech issues. Oh, I didn't get cloak for no- oh, I'm on the Predator battle suit still. <laughs> That's not, not what I meant to do. I meant to get her cloaked as well. Well, you know what? All of her friends are going to be invisible, and they're all going to go after... The enemies will go after Nova instead. That was... I... <laughs> I wanted to have a purely cloaked death force. Who are you? Go away. Oh, wait. They're all coming this way. What? Oh, wait. Did we lose that? Does it start out dead? What have I done? I don't think I started it, but I'm going to put a bunch of things here because we have spider mines from the auto turrets, right? In fact, why don't we just use this guy to repair or er, to defend? Let's uh, let's keep moving. I'm sorry. There's a lot of things I'm trying to keep track of. I want to make sure that everything works right. That is permanent cloaking. Oh yeah, that's permanent cloaking. That's really cool. Okay, let's try it. Here we go, bro. Executing. So how much damage do they do? Wait, nice. This is it, They're really good against Infested, right? They got the perfect numbers for it. Then we drop the little healy things to heal. I know. That's uh, bold. But you had to learn at some point that's what they're for. So one thing that's interesting here that I think is going to make this strategy a lot more viable 
is the fact that we don't have to take the expansion here. We just have to go over and grab the gases at it, right? Also, my Reapers are dead because a siege tank saw them. That's a little bit of a shame. Oh, they're not in the right place. But we're going to get some Reapers. Things are looking pretty grim for, for them, not for me. I'm feeling great. We probably want like a bunch of these, not a little bit of them, before we move out with them. I think they're more of a critical mass unit, you know. On the other hand, these Liberators gonna be great at going on adventures with Nova. The dynamic trio, they call them. Two Liberators and Nova Covert Ops herself. Yeah, spider mines are really nice. I like it. We might need even another barracks here. I don't know how long we can sustain this. Probably not that long. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Oh! We gotta save Nova. We got her. <laughs> The Herc compound. It makes Hercs, and now it makes Hercs Elise. As it should. As it should. What a great addition to this video game. That is brilliant. So. So. Let's uh, get everything set up, and then be prepared to go. Uh, let's, let's just unload you, and you guys are going to come over here and protect this. What are we going to use a Hercules for? Like, are Hercs even viable? What am I doing? Whatever. I don't care about you, Janara. You're a jerk face. Okay, we can salvage this, and we can grab a couple of these friends. We're going to build, I don't know, two bunkers here, and then two refineries going to get the gas going and then maybe we can maybe we can make some hercs as well oh they don't have a gas cost dude they don't have a gas okay 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 i am um my brain my brain juices are flowing we got reapers that cost all the gas and now we can go oh dude this is working out this just worked out perfectly oh this is gonna be great we're going reaper herc oh at some point, I'm going to realize that the difficulty on this mod is increased from the base campaign. So, in some ways, like the number of enemies. So I probably can't get away with this. But we're going to try. Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. Bring the Reapers. Try to save this area. So remember... Herks are immune to Baneling Acid, which is a very good ability. And then we also have the ability to turn the uh, enemy... Or rather, we have the ability to turn this into a planetary fortress, which is really nice. Usually this base is super hard to hold. But with planetary, I think it's going to be pretty easy. Oh. Well, when there's detection, their life isn't very good. It's okay. Oh, this is... I'm really interested here. I feel like this is actually going to work. It shouldn't, but it might. I still have no idea what I'm going to use Hercules for. I can't build more hurt compounds, right? No. So I'm going to have to do my best with that one. I wish I had Chrono Boost. Let's planetary this. And just hope. I mean, these are war pigs. They're good. We got a lot of gas incoming, and I feel like with the long build time of the Reaper, there's a reason 5 Racks Reaper was the build and not 3 Racks Reaper. Let's just get some more mines going. I really like this. The mine deployability on the Raven is an ability I've always been a fan of, so having it be even enhanced here is really cool. Let's get you guys building, and let's, uh, let's just keep clearing the map for a while. Hopefully we don't get destroyed by anything too violent. I mean, if we get a little bit destroyed, that's fine. I'm used to it. Up, 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 uh, there we go. 
Lunch time. Oh, that's a lot of lunch. Wait, I'm not going to eat them. <laughs> you know what I'm... Uh, mean Stepman. <laughs> so I will say these Reapers are not really impressing me, but that's fine. I mean, they are cheap. They're cheaper. Status <laughs> report. They'd be a lot better if I use the nukes. The emergen records indicate that the researchers had additional mines here. I'd imagine they had to leave some equipment. Guess who also has additional mines, Ragal? Yeah. I'll check it out. <laughs> Confirm that last. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Shut up. It was funny. <laughs> Uh, sorry, I'm a little bit losing my mind because I've been dealing all day with technical issues. And then, uh, I have, it's, uh, almost midnight. I'm recording this for the thing. I usually go to bed uh, between, like, 1 and 1.30 because I like to record at night because it's nice and quiet. Uh, I have, why are, why is my gas so high? Anyway, I, um, I have an event where Loco and I are competing in a co-op tournament thing against Harstum and Uptree Zelda. And it starts at 5 in the morning my time because no one else is anywhere near me proximity-wise. So I'm the one that decided to take the dive time zone-wise. So I'm like having a little bit of a meltdown on the fact that basically I'm 24 hours streaming it for a weird co-op event. It should be fun, but... <laughs> Oh, it's been a day. I've been working on a lot of stuff. Oh, this reactors. Okay, so we herc real quick. I like it. Let's get cracking. I literally need more barracks than this, don't I? Also, I have one unit that can hit air versus the Taldorim. Got it. So that was smart. I actually have a hypothesis, and that hypothesis is that if I leave the Taldorim alone, they'll run into this base, which is going to have a bunch of turrets at it. Oh wait, no, they're going right here, aren't they? Ah, oh, darn. Well, that doesn't work. Unfortunately, so, there may be someone out there that's like, oh, wouldn't it be cool if you just activated this and then had the infested kill? I tried it! And apparently what happens is the infested and them, when you start the thing, are teamed. They will ignore each other to kill you. Which, honestly, really lame. Like, just straight up, I think it's objectively lame. If I had an objective, it would be a lame one. Alright. Let's give this a go. I gotta say, my supply is very high. We have been able to afford the units. Is drawing invested toward the device. I actually think that I don't necessarily want the grapple turned on for these guys. I just want them to zone. Do I build a Hercules? I mean, no one ever lost because they built a Hercules. It's not even taking all my production time or anything. I just don't want to max my energy on that guy. Because I'm not really building base defenses, so I figure he can do it. Oh, there's the big boy brigade. Cool. Honestly, we are annihilating these infested. Is this good? No, this can't be good, right? Like... Intervene. There's uh oh spaghettios. Yeah, I said uh oh spaghettios. The Raven understood what I meant. He's here to save me. Uh, I wish I could disable the cloak. I just want to pull them over to a turret. There we go. Then the mines will take them out. Perfect. You have no value to me, but I got you. I'll check it out. I, I'm. I'll, I'll try to think of Nobody something. <laughs> Loud and clear. Okay, we gotta take down these. Take down the detection. 
And then we can bring everybody in. Got it. Take that down. One thing I really like about this campaign is that because... Oh, that was a fungal growth. Is that because in the first section, they use the actual statistics of units? Where are they going? Oh, our base. I need that. Okay. Let's bring the Hercules. He's, he's our emotional support, Hercules. <laughs> it's going to do his best for us. Uh-oh, Raven. Where'd I put ya? Drop that. Got it. Okay, we go this way then. They don't have detect... Oh, they have an oracle, but we can take it down. It has no energy. I like how the phoenixes don't even... One of them is bothering to chase the herc, and the others are like, eh, I don't care. Uh, this is... Objectively... T Oh, I thought they were going home for a moment. This is objectively not ideal. We need to start doing these. I mean, I have so much money. Requires Nova, yeah. So, they should just die as they try to attack that. And then we can... We can start this device. With our infinite Cloak Reaper Brigade. The, second device is operational. the Cloak Reapers take, like, a lot of CPU power. I can feel it. When they were moving, I was getting, like, 30. I think it's, like, the effect applied on them is not great for frame rate. And we'll have the Herc reinforcements to save us. Let's just uh, set this over here. Yeah, I feel like this is pretty safe from Sky Toss. What are they going to do? I need to make sure that I don't fight the the th the ones with the tanks, right? Just making sure there wasn't anything else back there, but yeah, we kind of crushed it. So the area here has tanks, and I think we need to avoid that one like the plague, <laughs> because it will just kill everything. Actually, wait, they won't be able to see us. Oh, whoa, 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 Banelink spawning on our faces. Oh, uh, that's not good. This is fine. Got it. Because we hard counter all the infested. Like, it's incredible. These have never felt so easy. And we need to keep it that way. The one with the Nidises? They're going to be Bidises because we're going to say bye. <laughs> Bidises, no. Got it. Oh gosh, I'm sorry. It's gonna make more reapers. Status report. Let's uh, let's go grab this while we're in the neighborhood. Did my Hercules die? It just floats in the ground until a PNG comes and picks it up. Okay, that's cool. All right, let's get this bonus. I, I'm glad that I'm making Herc's work. Of course, Herc work. Here he goes. I honestly have no idea how you're supposed to take this fight, so I just shoot this guy. I don't know. I kind of make up a lot of covert Nova. Like its title, I make up its title. I kind of make up a lot of this campaign as I go if it's not part of the speed run. Because I've only played it a few times on Brutal. <laughs> like, a surprisingly reasonable number of times. Oh, well, this guy's easy. I mean, he does, like, one-shot you if he hits, but as long as he doesn't hit, then I don't throw any fits. I wonder if there's a better weapon I could have gone for. I guess I really need this for the anti-air. If anyone's never seen the Easter egg in this before, if you die in here, it uh, drops a lot of souls, Dark Souls or Elden Ring style, which is funny. When you come back and try again. It is peak comedy. It's how I know that the developers are gamers. 
Uh-oh. Well, they'd be better gamers if they had more Vespine gas in their bases. I've got more Terrazine coming to you, Rigel. Not a big fan of that. Don't know why they didn't want to help me out there. Oh, well, someone killed my raven. The predator suit's honestly still pretty decent. Like, any infested that connect with Nova instantly die. I don't need to waste time trying to attack the... Oh, gosh. Hello. The aberrations, which is nice. Also... <laughs> The Hercs really just die, don't they? That is their professional qualification, is the ability to fall over dead in a quarter of a second. Oh, goodness. I don't have any anti-air. I'll have to figure that out later. Oh, goodness. I mean, I'm not starting any anti-air right now. If only I had that Hercules still, I could... Grab Nova and bring her to my main base. These guys are amazing. They're so good. I don't know why they're so good. Okay, they're going through my natural again, which is, of course, the meeting zone of all missile turrets. I don't know why I was scared about this. It's... Scouts. <laughs> uh, okay. It's, uh... I mean, they're, they do enough damage that we can't ignore them. Oh no, we're gonna be revealed. Oh no. Whatever shall we do? Okay. So it looks like it's... Wait, does the Predator Shot do... No. Okay. Yeah, it does a little like electric field animation and it wasn't doing it, but I wanted to make sure, right? Just to understand exactly how it works, because it would be very funny, wouldn't it? Say again. Alright, so we have one, two, three, four, five different options left. I think that we do this one, we head up here, then we do this one, and that one. Because this one has a lot of air, and this one has the siege tanks, which, as I said, won't be a problem, but I don't want to test my theory. Man, these Reapers are laggy. We beat them. I figure we're a little bit def def uh, defended over there. If something bad happens, right? Like, we should be okay. So yeah, I guess I should ask this again. I uh, talked about it a little bit at the beginning of the video, but if anyone knows, uh, I switched from NVIDIA to AMD as my graphics card. And I now have an issue where when I open StarCraft full screened, it uh, go like the first frame that renders, it just gets stuck on that frame. The game actually renders properly. Like I can see it in my OBI. That's a lot of air. I can see it in my preview window, and I can navigate through menus and stuff, which is how I got it onto proper full screen. But I like, I prefer windowed full screen, you know? I think that's a pretty common feeling in the world. Man, if only there was another cloaked unit. If only Nova could cloak. Imagine. Wouldn't that be crazy? Then we could have a fully invisible army, but unfortunately no one gave her that ability, so that's never going to happen. Because it's Nova Overt Cops, not, uh, not anything else. So she has to be overt and very visible. Get her. Yeah. Predator. Yeah. I like that. Alright, come get me. Please. There he is. It's our boy. Dawadiru himself. Never seen one of those before. He's unstoppable. Wait, is there something stuck inside of it? But we already knew that. I mean, he is shootable though. I'll make it happen. 
Good old bright blinger. Ow. <laughs> Still hurts. Um, Predator Armor might not be the tool for this one. Oh. Wait a moment. This is looking really bad. Oh, dude. Oh! We got it. Ah, it's a prototype <laughs> for new equipment. Yeah. You're going to like this, Rigel. You're going to like it, Rigel. I already do. I don't like Rigel. Huh? He's not, he's not the greatest character. But he already do. I wish we could move the orbital command, like float it up over here and then have Nova get dropped off by the school bus. Where are you guys going? What is your story? Where did you come from? Whoa. Uh, my game just minimized. That's cool. This is why I don't like <laughs> full screen. Oh, hello. Okay, it was all part of the plan. I knew I was going to get a hit by this, and that Nova. is why I got Nova killed by Bright Blinger. Bright Blight. Br I hate him. Obliterate an extraction device. <laughs> Show them the full extent of our power. Uh, he might be the Bright Blinger, but I'm the Fight Bringer. Yeah. There, I, I salvaged that one. Now I sound cool. I'm scared of these banelings. They, they do hurt. Nova's so slow. So what I'm figuring we have going on here is that if we lose, we can make marines. Right? Like, if all my stuff dies, which is looking more and more possible because of all these banelings that are spawning... We have barracks. We have 4,000 marines. Or four, I wish. 4,000 minerals. We can probably figure it out. Yeah, you can see that here they're hostile to the enemy. However, if you start the event, they suddenly unhostilify. Which is lame. They uh don't be they don't shoot the infested anymore. Fortunately, Nova does have the ability to solo capital ships. I'm really looking forward to this real scale if it ever gets made. I'm not sure it will. We'll see. But uh I wanna see how Nova does against <laughs> Janara in real scale. I think she'll be a little humbled. Now. Got any tech to make it go faster, Rigel? No, I'm afraid not. Cause Rigel's lame. Okay, so these guys. I think I'm just gonna hold position all of the Reapers and then target fire like that. It seems pretty good for now. Little pop outs over here are what I'm afraid of. Like, if any of those are banelings, then we're gonna take so much damage, it's gonna be absolutely catastrophic. Uh. Status report. I'll make it happen. If Nova dies, I think we'll still be able to live even with the Banshees attacking. Right? That seems legit. Oh, we just took a lot of supply. Also, I am completely out of happiness. Ugh. This is a lot of guys. Oh, dude. Okay. Get out of here, sir. Bainling. Oh, hi. <laughs> How are you? That's great to see you. I didn't expect to see you here, but you know, there you are. I could not care any less than I currently am. Like, this is not my responsibility right now, game. Just get Nova on the point. We gotta get out of here. This is terrible. The last device is firing up. We're almost done here. 
I like to believe that these guys will be enough to hold on this side. I've... I've played enough of this game to know that's not the case. Okay. You guys over here to repair as well. Oh, there's blocking. Well, whatever. Just make sure that the repairing is happening. Lost the big boys. Here's the Nidus. But we got... Oh, yeah, the Reapers are so good against that. They are really good. I was right. Very happy with it. Uh, spider mines not helping too much against them. I'm sure they did great. Oh, hi. Yeah, you, uh... You didn't mention you brought your friends. Alright, that device is fine. Is it really gonna get periled so fast? I don't think so. I think that you're just a Debbie Downer, Mr. Rigel. Or should I call you Debbie? You know, if we make a cloak wall out of cloaked units, then we're probably not going to lose. Just hold position, just like that strategy on In Outer Darkness with the DTs. <laughs> Fine. Listen. Hybrid on iron. Yeah. Just, it's that easy. I mean, this is just a simple mission. Okay. That's her name. Don't wear it out. All right, my friends. That was... <laughs> it worked really well at the beginning, and I don't advise the strategy at all. It's quite bad. But it worked. <laughs> so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Grant doing dumb stuff. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.